Another dead village. Yablochkovo. The facility complexes, especially Pavlov, obtain certain resources from here. The automatic sorting hub is used to provide the nearby factory with birds and animals for creating neuropolitics. Science is a real zero-sum game for game. What a clever pun. I'm impressed. Yeah, whatever.
another dead village. Yablochko. The facility complexes, especially Pavlov, obtain certain resources from here. The automatic sorting hub is used to provide the nearby factory with birds and animals for creating neuropolymers. Science is a real zero-sum game for game. What a clever pun. I'm impressed. Yeah, whatever. Please select the desired procedure. Please select the desired procedure. Select the desired procedure.
was a surprise. Cowardly fuck Petrov is hiding behind a dozen layers of robots. He is attempting to survive, but you're right, comrade Major. Now that he's in the theater, he has nowhere to run. This is his last chance. He doesn't stand a chance in hell. Access granted. Crispy critters. An overgrown dumpling like that almost burned me down back in Forester Village. You're now fully on, Comrade Major. We won't be able to enter the theater as long as the Beliash is guarding the entrance. We'll be inside in five minutes flat. I can't. Wait to pay that thing back with interest.
Please select the desired procedure. There's a stream of pure energy in her eyes. She understands me uh, better than any girl ever has. Anyway, I've made up my mind. I'm proposing to her tomorrow. <laughs> what the fuck are you doing here, Vasily? Are you working here or not? Shit, uh, I'm coming. Charles, can you track Petrov's whereabouts? Unfortunately, no. Petrov is no longer broadcasting. I will track him as soon as he does. Gotcha. That means he won't do it again. That dirty, rotten scumfuck is hiding away in some dark corner, and he's gonna sit there and hope the robots kill me before I find him. I ought to warn you that Petrov knows this theater quite well. He has good reason to hope for such an outcome. Hope is dangerous. 
It'll lull him into a false sense of security. Give me intel on the theater. The Maya Plisetskaya Theater was founded at the facility in 1948. It was the first theater in the world to use robots as performers. It is the most famous theater in the Soviet Union, so tickets can be quite hard to come by. So it's for the rich and powerful. You have no idea. Before the theater was fully roboticized, party members would order the best ballerinas in the Soviet Union to be transferred here. But after the performers were replaced with robots, it became so successful, it's now easier to get an apartment near the Kremlin than it is to attend a performance here. Can you tell me anything more useful and less disgusting? As part of the facility, the theater is without a doubt a scientific establishment. Its artistic vein is melded with commerce, as is the study of robot behavior and human reactions to it. I have no combat-related data. How does Petrov know this theater so well? It was one of the areas his activities were focused on before he was declared a traitor. So, he's a nostalgic puppet master, huh? He configured and tested the theater's robots and also programmed and studied the interplay of various crafts. In a certain sense, Collective was born on the stage of this theater. How'd that prick start working here? He was recommended by Comrade Stockhausen. Oh yeah, no wonder. They're both lousy pieces of shit. Pardon me, but I failed to understand why you put Comrade Stockhausen on the same level as a traitor. Hang on. How'd Petrov manage to butter up Sechenov? Did that lickspittle Stockhausen recommend him to the boss too? Victor Petrov optimized the robot control loading protocols. Data loading speed was tripled. That was when Comrade Stockhausen recommended Petrov to Dr. Sechenov. Shouldn't have done that. Let's go see what's what. Authorization. Major Nichayev, codename P3. Major, are you here to finish me off, dog? Then come on down. I am all yours. Without a woman for so long, Major, I can tell. dog. Your master sticks you on someone and you go right for the throat. <laughs> Just do me a favor. And do it. Charge, okay? What is that? Ooh, that door is electrified. It's a trap. Son of a bitch! I'm still gonna get you! Hang on, comrade major. I'll try to reduce the charge. I don't care if I got a crop. I'm gonna get that motherfucker. I've reduced the charge. Are you okay, comrade major? Had worse. Much worse. He's not getting away from me. to Maya Plusetskaya Robotic Theater, home of the world's first troupe of robotic performers. Hello there. 
Buy tickets in advance for our spectacular performance. Heart of the Robot, a peaceful atom. <laughs> Doesn't seem all that peaceful to me. Emotional thrill guaranteed. The play features fine humor, epic battles, fantastic special effects, and a touch of heart-wrenching drama. And that's it? No other surprises? We prepared a special surprise for you to commemorate the launch of Collective 2.0. Crispy critters, what is it? You will personally take part in the performance. <laughs> this ballerina has been reprogrammed. Yeah, like everything else here. I gathered as much. What are you trying to accomplish here, Petrov? You will be blown away by our prima Natasha's performance. Shit. We both know how this is going to end. Natasha's celebratory firework is the performance you will never forget. Did you even come from? Roboticized theater. It's the first of its kind in the world, and it's based on your design. I've made a few little tweaks here and there, of course. Comrade Sechenov, Comrade Zaharov, please. 
follow me. What a wonderful evening, Dimitri. What an incredible performance. I propose a toast to Boshov. Science has never been so close to, uh, triumph. Please select the desired procedure. Access granted. Please select the desired procedure. Where do guys like Petrov even come from in a flourishing society like ours? Welcome to our mind-blowing show. The main character is about to get mobbed by the audience. Thank <laughs> you. 
Have you found Petrov's trail, Comrade Major? I've driven him into a trap. He's got nowhere to run. Is Dr. Filatova with him? No, Petrov's alone. Aren't you maybe just a little too interested in what happens to her stock? You didn't happen to betray your friend because of her, did you? You just crossed the line, Major P3. I demand that you cease these outrageous insults at once. And I demand that you shut up and stop annoying me with your witness existence. I am carrying out the order of Dr. Sechenov. Dmitry Sergeyevich wants to know when you deliver Petrov to him. Your protege has nowhere to run. He's gone nuts. He's watching me through the cameras, reciting poetry, and screaming hysterically into the loudspeaker. I'll take him alive within the hour. Try not to fail, Dmitry Sergeyevich, at least this time. Fuck you. You shouldn't behave like this. Comrade Stockhausen is blameless. He is genuinely trying to help. Yeah, right. He's genuinely trying to steal Petrov's woman. confessed his slander of Comrade Sechenov. He's already starting to rally a large number of followers and is planning to destroy Soviet society's faith in the better future that is collective. Yes, I have the recording. Tomorrow at the Botanical Garden. Send in the Department of Corrections. Cash will be fine. Thank you. Dirty has agreed.
Please select the desired procedure. Charles. Yes, Major. Petrov's lost his shit. Following an analysis of Petrov in light of his recent quarrel with Larissa Falatova, I have drawn the same conclusion. You analyzed him? It's a common scenario. He loved her. Their perspectives on life grew apart. She ended the relationship. He lost his mind. Huh. Makes sense, I guess. What kinds of shows do they put on here? Primarily ballet. A performance entitled Heart of the Robot, A Peaceful Atom, has been particularly popular recently. A celebratory performance is planned here in honor of the launch of Collective 2.0. Space-based programs honoring the first Soviet citizen in space will come later. We'll see. This place is pretty messed up right now. Say, are the... Ballerinas here. Just ballerinas. The topic of robosexuality is extremely popular among the Soviet elite. Robosexual lobbies have become quite powerful, and it would seem that the sale of related services is flourishing at the theater. In other words, no, the ballerinas are not just ballerinas. Do you think the boss knows about this? What do you think? Well... Given the robots he's chosen as bodyguards, guess he's a robosexual himself. According to Ozhigov's Dictionary of the Russian Language, the word robosexual is a facetious term for a person who enjoys intimate relations with machines, generally while manipulating... Okay, I get it. He can go ahead and manipulate whatever he wants. What he does with those androids of his is none of my business. But I gotta admit, they are kind of hot. Stand down for now. Hush. Fading data.
remade this place? I, I, used, I used to run this whole place all. Although, come to think of it, <laughs> I guess I still do. <laughs> Off your nut, Vasilich. Those party members can do whatever the fuck tickles their fancy, but you? What? You haven't got fucked enough by electricity in your life, so you want to get revenge by fucking it back? Anyway, I saw you making googly eyes at that doll in the dressing room. She's a bot, Vasilich. A robot. People keep asking me, hey, why is that electrician always in the coat check room? Why isn't he working? I ain't gonna cover your ass no more. Aren't you ashamed of yourself? You're making us both look bad. The electrician is the only one who knows the code for this door! Damn his eyes! 
So how did you give up the ghost? Was it mutants? Electrocution, damn it! So are you the electrician? No, I'm not. But if you find the sillage, you put him down like a fucking dog. You hear me? Kill that lousy egghead son of a bitch. That yeah, will do, after he gives me the code. He keeps yammering about electricity. You know it when you meet him. supposed to be prima ballerina me if i ever get my hands on you i'll choke the life out of you don't make me laugh prima you failed even at croaking first they always threw flowers for me even as i lay dying keep your flippers to yourself hey you yes you which of us died in a prettier way was it me or she Um, I think her pose is more technical. What? Thank God I am already dead. Indeed. Art is long and life is short. supposed to be prima ballerina me if i ever get my hands on you i'll choke the life out of you don't make me laugh prima you failed even at croaking first they always threw flowers for me even as i lay dying keep your flippers to yourself hey you yes you which of us died in a prettier way was it me or she I think I'm done with both of you. This is giving me a headache. Oh, plebeian. No taste for finer things. Tough crowd indeed. The electrician's the only one who knows the code for this door. Damn his eyes! So where do I find him? Fuck Divino! The electrician's the only one who knows the code for this door! 
damn his eyes. Okay, that's enough. For now, anyway. was to be happy with my woman. Weren't you ever happy with yours? Do you even know what happiness is? That's mighty profound, you sick fuck, but it won't help you. How the hell could I even know if I was happy or not? I wish I did, but here we are. <laughs> Крокодил не ловится, не растет покос. Плачут Богу молятся, не жалея слез. Плачут Богу молятся, не жалея слез. Крокодил не ловится, не растет покос. Вроде не бездельники и могли бы быть. Им бы в понедельнике взять и отменить. Им бы в понедельнике взять и отменить. Вроде не бездельники и могли бы быть. Как раз у нас принят комментарий. We're all just electrical stream, just ones and zeros. Every power outlet knows that. One, five, zero, six, zero, six, fifteen. What's that? A code or something? Are you dumb? It is the date of the new concert. Everybody knows that. Even simple electricians know that. Would a simple electrician know the door code? The code? How did it go? One moment. Top button on the right, or was it left? The bottom, Le left one, I bet. Or was it both? Mm. Well, shit, what was it again? I've spoken. Crispy critters. supposed to enter it. The password appears not to be a password at all.
rip your heart out. Easy now. Everybody here. We got the girls. The men are here too. Uh, uh, sorry, I'm late. My wife's sick, and I had to pick my kids up from daycare. And... It's okay, Constantine. We get it. Have a seat. 
Yeah, stay. Sorry. Well then, comrades. Why have I brought you all together at such a late hour? <laughs> How much longer will we tolerate the yoke of bourgeois vice in this sacred home of art? <coughs> How much longer will the gluttonous despot fray our nerves and pull our strings like a perverted puppet master? How much longer will there be foul fingers? Uh, uh, sorry, I got a little carried away there. What I wanted to say is, Lastochkin is an asshole. Pardon my French. But we can't just sit back while our girls and some of our boys get turned into bourgeois prostitutes. Well now, what do we have here? Boys, very good. <gasps> and girls too, eh? Hmm, excellent. Arrest them. Charles, what did you just turn on? A temporary malfunction, Major. I am now operating within normal parameters. Authorization. Major Nichayev, codename P3, access... Granted. Granted.
Oh, you're a tough nut to crack. Oh, I can't even soften you up. Sechno said, seek him, and you can't disobey. That's fine. Solve my puzzle, P3. I'll try to reach you one last time. Release your creativity. Use the right side of your brain. Paint pictures of the future. And you'll see where Sechenov's real plan is going to take us. You'll find the canvas right here. The ballerina's training is proceeding magnificently. We just need to show them the proper ballet positions. It's a shame they aren't connected to the primary neural network. Just imagine what we could teach them. And most importantly, no polymer injections whatsoever. Truly fantastical women. Just say the name of the position, and that's it. And it doesn't have to be a ballet position either. What the hell was that? Charles, I don't know what you mean, Comrade Major. The chirper you found is broken and silent. Debug mode initiated. Please enter a command. Uh, I don't really get this stuff. Want to give it a whirl, Charles? Attitude? Let's try a different one. Classe in the fifth position, arms in the third position. Done already? Oh my, you're talented. This isn't new to you, though, is it? Do you want to see the same scenes repeated all around us? Or would you rather choose clear sky, carefree birdsong, and all the comforts of home? Unless you want to hear the heavy footfalls of the robot army marching against mankind, stand down. Okay, that's enough. Debug mode initiated. Please enter a command. Yeah, Charles, do me a favor and give the lady a command, would you? I... I don't know what she wants. First arabesque. Try another one. Attitude? That's enough of that. Debug mode initiated. Please enter a command. Your move, Charles. I'm kind of out of my depth here. Batemont tendu, arms free. Anything else worth checking out? Quasse in the fourth position. Enough for now. Debug mode initiated. Please enter a command. This is your time to shine, Charles. You're a smart-ass machine, right? Well, we got some smart-ass commands for you to figure out. First arabesque. 
Try again. Give her a command. Passe. We're done here. Debug mode initiated. Please enter a command. Uh, I don't really get this stuff. Want to give it a whirl, Charles? Passe. Mode initiated. Please enter a command. Yeah, Charles, do me a favor and give the lady a command, would you? I... I don't know what she wants. Releve on the toes, croce in the fourth position, big arms in an allongé. Debug mode initiated. Please enter a command. Your move, Charles. I'm kind of out of my depth here. Releve in the fingers. Anything else worth checking out? Attitude. Anything else worth checking out? Batemont tendu, arms free. Anything else worth checking out? Debug mode initiated. Please enter a command. This is your time to shine, Charles. You're a smart-ass machine, right? Well, we got some smart-ass commands for you to figure out. A la seconde, arms free. Debug mode initiated. Please enter a command. Your move, Charles. I'm kind of out of my depth here. Passe in the fourth position. Anything else worth checking out? Releve in the fingers. Anything else worth checking out? Attitude? The sky is alight with sunsets raging Enough for now. Crimson. Now comes the dark. Sechnoff thinks he can control all of Collective, but he can't. No one can control a power like this. Tell me, P3. Why do you assume that these robots kill? For no reason? Because I'm evil incarnate and I programmed them that way? <sighs> Think again. Debug mode initiated. Please enter a command. Yeah, Charles, do me a favor and give the lady a command, would you? I... I don't know what she wants. Releve in the fifth position. F.A.C. 
arms upright, and loose in an elongate. Sometimes you think you're gaining on your nemesis, and he'll be within your grasp soon enough. And then everything will be happiness, smiles, and rainbows. You have no idea how insidious your real enemy is. And not even Sechenov truly understands it. What you're all really going to end up with is emptiness, powerlessness, and a mushroom cloud. Debug mode initiated. Please enter a command. Uh, I don't really get this stuff. Want to give it a whirl? Debug mode initiated. Uh, I don't really get this stuff. Want to give it a whirl, Charles? Attitude? Let's try a different one. Classe in the fifth position, arms in the third position. Open your eyes and see the truth, dog. Why can't you see the obvious? Collective will be the death of us all. Sechnov is nothing but a self-indulgent fool. Fine. You win. This was supposed to be a real show. And now no one will ever see it except a stray dog. Yeah, Charles, why is that head case whining about how Collective is going to kill us all? I can't stop thinking about it. Could Collective really be dangerous? Of course not. Collective cannot be dangerous. That's all there is to it. Only its owner can be dangerous. You mean his discretionary authority? Indeed. It exists. There is no getting around it. The Alpha Connector, the one that gives you total control over Collective. There's only one of them. You said that yourself, right? Indeed. What conclusion do you draw from that? As long as Dr. Sechenov has the Alpha Connector, we got nothing to worry about. Is that so? Of course. Dr. Sechenov is as honest as the day is long. He's a hero of the Soviet Union, a genius who made our country what it is today. You know the boss better than me, Charles. I sincerely hope you're right. What's that supposed to mean? It means that too much has happened over the last 24 hours. All these events force one to see things from a different perspective. Like what? Consider this. What will happen if the Alpha Connector winds up in the hands of a man who wants to enslave the entire world? <laughs> Dr. Sechenov would never let that happen. Molotov's dead, and nobody else would take it from him. And even if someone did, they couldn't do shit before Monday. And after that, it'll be protected by the whole collective network. Perhaps. But Dr. Sechenov will also control every aspect of the network security apparatus. Yeah, I guess so. So you've also come to realize that Dr. Sechenov will not destroy the Alpha Connector after Collective launches. That's why you said that the Connector would be protected, isn't it? Well, maybe he needs discretionary authority for his brilliant research and stuff. Why would his research require that? Would people connected to Collective really refuse any practical request? made by the man who catapulted them into the next phase of evolution? Would you, Comrade Major? Well, I... Yeah, I mean, I... Petrov's close. Any suggestions? In regard to your question, Victor has made a number of significant alterations to the theater. Arresting him will not be easy, even in light of his obvious psychological breakdown. Prepare carefully, and try to avoid the Vova's attacks. As for your own condition, I have one thing to say. There, there. There, there? What the f- what? There, there, Major. Everything is going to be all right. <laughs> is that what your programming tells you to say when somebody's upset? You dumbass gizmo. Your understanding of my software algorithms has vastly improved. That is laudable. <laughs> there, there. Why all this art and murder? What's that little weasel up to? I have run a diagnostic on your body. My access to certain internal components is blocked. Hypothetically, Petrov could be attempting to interact with these components in order to influence you, like you. 
He is in a state of extreme psychological tension. You just noticed that? Following the electromagnetic shock administered by Petrov, I performed a mandatory reboot and detected the presence of unauthorized internal components. I have insufficient data to determine whether or not these elements were hidden from my systems during my initial installation. So what are they? There are blank areas concealed from my diagnostic algorithms. They could be polymer cavities caused by repeated use of the glove's abilities. Or they could be bullet wounds in your head. Crispy critters. You think I've got a goddamn bullet lodged in my brain? I could perform a deeper analysis, but the diagnostics could cause pain, vomiting, loss of consciousness, and extended migraines. Stay out of my head, Charles. I'll get a checkup after we get back from the mission. Nobody's gonna own Collective. Dr. Sechenov is gonna launch it and everybody's gonna be equal. Brilliant scientists like him are above power struggles and other petty bullshit like that. So, what will it be, Major? Weapons? Granted. Fool me again. You're mine now, shitbird. Hear that, fuckhead? Show's over! There you are. Always breathing down my neck. Where's the doctor? Larissa. She... she dumped me. Unbelievable. I don't know where she is. Maybe she's... Dead. What about Molotov? He didn't believe such enough, did he? Molotov's dead. Then it all makes sense. What makes sense? Collective will activate, and that's the end of everything. What? What's wrong with people controlling robots with their minds? You're the one who created the goddamn system, you prick. I had no idea what Sechenov was planning to do with it. Unlike you, he wasn't planning to kill anybody. <laughs> oh, really? You believe that? Then why did all those peaceful robots start hacking everyone? Because you reprogrammed them, that's why. <laughs> Are you serious? How stupid can you get? Do you have any idea how long it takes to write a functional algorithm for a single robot? And there are dozens of models here. So what? <laughs> I'll tell you what. Combat mode was programmed into them during the initial design phase. And sure, no one ever thought it'd be activated here in the Soviet Union, and that was totally on me. <laughs> but I can assure you that Sechenov's plans are far, far worse than this, and he has to be stopped! Bullshit! I'm sick of this crap. You're gonna tell me right now how to switch the robots out of combat mode. <laughs> Sorry. That's not gonna happen. Hell it will. <laughs> I've already put everything into motion. Stop! This was supposed to be I said a stop. special day for us. <laughs> I was going to propose to her the day Collector was launched. It was going to happen right here in the theater. House and Bond. Watch out, your hands! Give this to Larissa. Fuck me, you clown. 
definitely dead this time. Shit. P3 to Chilame. Come in, Chilame. Finally. Do you have Victor? Petrov killed himself in a creative way, and I couldn't stop him. Damn! Is his head intact? Yes. I'm looking at it right now. Keep the head safe, P3. I'll send you a special container. Put it inside, and the rest will be done automatically.
Let's just not talk for a while, okay? Sergey, did you search Petrov's body, my lord? Did you find any gold rings on him? No, sir. Petrov didn't have anything on him. Very well. Report to the Pavlov complex at once. Yes, sir. I'm on my way. your current status, Comrade Major. I'm detecting a loss of focus and an intense surge of emotion. My status? I'm losing my fucking shit. That's my goddamn status. I failed my mission again. Victor's dead, and I've got his head in a damn jar, and Sechenov thinks that's all fine and fucking dandy, get it? No, Comrade Major. I've done a lot of shit in my day, okay, but I've never lugged a human head around as a trophy. Did you see that gigantic robot in the theater? There was a combat robot in the theater, Charles. But you know what really grinds my gears? No, Comrade Major. The rings. The motherfucking rings that asshole Petrov gave me. And you know why it grinds my gears? No, Comrade Major. Me neither. Shit. Whatever. It's okay. I'm fine. I'm fine. Uh, we're headed to Pavlov. Got any ideas? Pavlov is a secret complex, located in a remote part of Facility 3826, called Sahalin. It would be quite difficult to get there on foot, given the large number of enemies. I suggest taking a vehicle. And, Comrade Major, this would also be an excellent time to enhance your arsenal as much as possible. Searching for other testing grounds is highly recommended. Enough complaining. Let's move. There, there, Major. Whatever you say. Authorization, Major Nietzsche. What will it be, Major? Weapon. 